There has been a mass exodus away from the DP World Tour, formerly known as the European Tour, and as with most things in golf these days, it has everything to do with Live Golf. Here's what's happening. So Live Golf has signed a bunch of older European players who have had great careers on their home continent. Guys like Lee Westwood, Ian Poulter, Sergio Garcia, and Henrik Stenson. Now that put the DP World Tour in a bit of a tough position because they've had this strategic alliance with the PGA Tour for a few years. So the DP World Tour opted to fine players for every Live event that they play in. The more Live events you play in the more that you're fined now this was challenged in court and live golfers were actually allowed to play dp world tour events as the case moved through courts in england but the dp world tour won the court case last month which upheld their right to find these guys and suspend them now these guys don't want to pay the fines last week sergio garcia ian poulter lee westwood and richard bland all resigned their dp world tour memberships and they've since been joined by henrik stenson now why does this all matter because you have to be a member of the DP World Tour in order to be eligible